Well, Dave Callahan gets four runs with his first shot of this Mandela Trophy series. Just clipping away with Simon Dool, backward of point for four. Well, there's runs at this time for Callahan, at least a couple. Just backward of square. That's a lovely shot through the offside. Cover drive, four runs. And this one's off the pads, and this will run away for four leg buys. In fact, it does. So at the end of eight overs, South Africa now 38 for one. And there's runs here for Callahan. Cape Town wasn't a great track, but all the others that I've seen it should be producing 260 runs in one day cricket. Well, this one's swung away, and that's gone for six. Just dropping it short that time, Simon Dool and Dave Callahan very quickly into position. Free license. Well, this time he's been clipped away for four runs, just backward of squirt. Short cover and Stephen Fleming at a short mid wicket. Well, he's put it over that fielder at short mid wicket and pulled it away for four. Well, he really he does have to bowl full. He's got to get the player coming forward and just perhaps mistime things as they come into the drive. But he's dropped his short. One for 71. Chris Harris again strays a little bit in line. And again, the South Africans pick up two runs on the leg side. Well, that was just to the left of a diving Shane Thompson. Just a bit wide of him. And he's repeated the shot and he's hit this one better. That's through mid-wicket for four runs. Well, Chris Harris really has to give the ball just a little bit more air than this. He's bowling slightly quicker than he has in the last couple of games. Oh, this one drops just short of Simon Dool. That fine leg and... Dave Callahan continues his very good batting form out there. And Chris Harris over pitching outside the off stump. A very nice cover drive. And that's poor bowling from Chris Harris. Just dropping too short down the leg side. And Dave Callahan now reaches his 50. That's his first 50 in one day international cricket. And well played too, a standing ovation as one would expect. Four more. Well, I don't know where this consistency is. I mean, these fellows are professionals out there. It's their job. I'm sure you can have an off day, but you can't expect four or five bowlers to have off day. Really dissecting the two men there. Well, that's a great drive there from Dave Callahan. That's four runs through mid-off. That's pulled away again by Callahan. At the end of the over, South Africa now 148 for one. And that's a very, very good shot from Dave Callahan. He tried it once before off Thompson and Murphy Sewer, unfortunately, at long off, unfortunately, long on, sorry, for New Zealand, put what was a relatively easy catch down. Dave Callahan, who's 98 not out at this stage, as he plays a predetermined shot, and that could be his 100. He's scampering through for one. He's turning, and he's got his century, and the crowd has risen as one, and we can see the elation from the South African team and Dave Callahan, and what a milestone that is for him. Well, that will go for six. In fact, that's gone ten rows back. That's a huge hit from Dave Callahan. Of course, this is the highest score by any South African in limited overs internationals, and this one's gone for six. Well, he's, he's just ripping up the record books, Dave Callahan. The previous highest score by our South African in one-day international cricket was 112. Again, that's just swatted away, backward of square. Four more runs to Dave Callahan. As Murphy Sewer comes in again. And again, there's that swing across the line from Dave Callahan. There's four more runs. 149. And now 150. Well played. That's a very, very well played inning. There's a standing ovation. One or two people running on. Dave Callahan very happy with himself today. Salutes the crowd. Toss and with away, and Mark Priest 
does stop it. It doesn't. In fact, it's just rolled over the boundary. So that's four. They'll obviously have get up. They'll obviously get up to win. Another full toss played square on the offside, and they're back for two. And that's going to go for four runs as it lands about six inches inside the boundary. Simon Dahl absolutely on a hiding to nothing. There's very little he can do except try and get them right up there in the block hole. And so he's got it up in the block hole, except this time it's a full toss. So what he tried to do was right. But you can't stop this man. Uh, this is a magnificent innings. No matter what he touches today, is going to turn into boundaries towards the end of the innings. Four off. Two balls a go. And unbelievable. Look at that. That's cheeky again as he sweeps it just behind square. He's going to go for two, and it could be tight if the throw's better. Poor return for Brian Young. As Simon Dahl runs into the ball, the last ball of the innings. And he'll only get a single, so that'll make it 314 for seven. Callahan will move to 169. And undoubtedly a great standing ovation. Very happy man leaving Centurion Park. 169 not out in a one-day international. Magnificent performance and some very, very fine batting. And that he's hit 19 fours, four sixes. And Dave Callahan certainly the man of the moment. South Africa through to 314 for seven or 50 overs. What a fine effort. But for the New Zealanders, really they can't waste their time at lunchtime. They've got to sit down. They've got to discuss the way of going out and attacking this total. Richard, I think we could have a fine afternoon.